so there you have it i literally took this guy out from above all i needed to do was just wiggle this thing this hose is flexible around the power steering hose there and i literally pulled it up out like this so i think i found the problem there is a problem this piece of rubber somehow got trapped down in between the the thermostat there that prevented it from seating down properly so that's what was causing my temperature my 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 my, my thermostat from um, being able to close fully not sure how that got there but obviously it did maybe some faulty installation from factory or repair i'm not sure all right so i'm just quickly comparing it with my replacement before my battery goes and there you have it they pretty much look alike and um oem as they say all right so i hope this helps someone um i'm gonna go ahead and fit pull these off put onto this and then just do the reverse of everything that i said so as you can see my fan housing and everything is still in place i basically pulled it up rather than pushing it down in order to get it out right in my hand there it is maybe dark but yeah you won't be able to see that thank you for tuning in and um i hope this helps someone um best of luck in your project if you do have such a one thanks for watching bye and of course it's the winter time and i'm literally almost on ice i just found a little spot here it was pretty dry my lucky day eh cheers bye now oh by the way i think i should say uh if you're watching this video you probably you will need to watch part one to this video because my battery my my uh memory ran out and i started a new recording um on how to replace the thermostat on my 2010 ford focus all right so um watch part one you'll see the full step-by-step -step process how i avoided having to remove all my radiator shrouding fan and all of that stuff there and how i was able to just pull this up out of here relatively easily all right this was a trial and obviously it worked thanks for tuning in again Bye for now. Alright, so I have reinstalled the new thermostat on the my existing uh, hoses for my radiator thingy. Um, what I did to keep things simple and in order, I made a line on the original one. There are three there are two little bumps there's one down there and there's one there I, I made a line on the hose there you can see the compression there it's kind of gone and i made another one right there just to keep things in line when putting it back on the putting it on the the new one so that things are things remain in line of course i put these in the same slots that i took them from to keep things as secure what i think i'll do is